What did I do? Well, it sounds like you committed a battery and you resisted. How do I now, commit a battery? Now, fight or flight response is built into everyone when faced with fear. Most of us would choose the latter. However, when law enforcement is involved, no one should feel like running. I'm not gonna, we, I'm we, not we gonna fight, I promise, not, I swear, I, we please. We know, we know you I'm not gonna out. do it. As an innocent with nothing to hide should not feel unsafe. Get out. Come on out my house, man. Unless they have skeletons in their closet. From someone interrupting an arrest to someone being aggressive near a child. You are under arrest. Do not resist. Why? Here are some incidents when evil woman realized she'd been caught. Okay, is, there, <laughs> is this your car? No. Is this Kelsey's car? Nope. Well, whose car is this? The incident revolved around a 32-year-old man named Colton Boyd and a 26-year-old woman named Kelsey Rich. On the 2nd of June, 2022 in Illinois, the police officers responded to a report of a DUI. Dispatch advised there were two customers kicked out of a bar for being too intoxicated. Later, they were located in a black Chevy Malibu in the parking lot. Wasting no time, the cops began their investigation. Each situation is a unique scenario with its own challenges. The police are always prepared to use the extent of their knowledge and power to tackle these challenges to reach a solution. Sometimes the hurdles they are about to face rears its ugly face sooner rather than later. Just like in the case of Colton and Kelsey. Stop. Step out for me, so you don't, I don't want him to take off. My pants, okay. I just don't want him to take off, and you get injured. Please, okay? please don't. We have a seven. Okay, what's going on? Nothing is going. Are you just upset because we're here? Or no, did something no, happen? We, were, we weren't upset. Please don't. Please don't. Okay, tell me what happened. Nothing happened. Okay, what are you so upset about? Nothing. Are you just upset because we're here? That's okay. What? Please don't. Please. Okay. You just do. Please. Don't. Don't touch me, please. What's your name, bud? Do you have an ID on you? Please don't. Please don't. Okay. And see your ID. Don't touch me. Okay. Well, stay back over here by the car. Do not touch me. Stay back over here by the car. You're not free to go. I know not. Then give me your ID. I know not. Do not he give me your ID. Wasn't he was not I just watched him drive. He wasn't driving. No, no, he wasn't. Hey, see your ID. He, wa he wasn't driving. No, he wasn't driving. Which one driving. follow? Which one follow? Which one follow? No, he wasn't driving. You're not gonna catch me. I mean, you're really not. Okay. No. He was. He was. He, he, he wasn't driving. Touch me again. You're going to jail. Back on him, he's taking off running. Please, please, I'm not take off, shut the f up. Give me your driver's you license. Give me your God, license. you <laughs> You <laughs> You <laughs> Don't f you touch no, me. Please don't, please don't, don't, please don't touch me. Don't touch me. Like that. No, 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 no. Pick it up. You, you uh, what? I'm going to Yep. Wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. Don't oh, f***ing hurt him. Don't hurt him. Seriously, he's like 120 pounds. Like, seriously. What did I do? Look at you guys compared to him. Don't hurt him. No, for real. What did I do? And you guys can't even tell me. Seriously. I'm going out. Man. You're under arrest. Leave her alone. No. I didn't do it. No. No, 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 no. no. No, Dad, stop yeah. Leave her alone. Let go of my arm. Leave her alone. Leave her alone. Leave her alone. Leave her alone. I didn't do anything. Do you understand? Please, please, I didn't do anything. Please, I didn't do anything. I won't, I won't do it. I won't arrest. I, I didn't do anything. Put your feet down. I promise. Mac, I'm 67. We got two in custody. I promise I won't do it. 
Where are you going? Nowhere. I'm not f***ing going anywhere. Okay, sit down. I'm gonna stand up. It makes me uncomfortable. Hey, hey, I can stand the f*** up. I'm not doing anything. Sit down. Sit down. I'm not doing anything. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. I don't want to. Okay, well, I stand. you're gonna sit down. Sit. Okay, sit. No, I'm not doing anything. Oh, hey, by the way, y'all Y'all, hey, dead ass. See, now look, look how the f*** that f***. Works, right? Hey. That's how that works, Wait, right? Y'all puss yeah. For real, I ain't done a fing thing wrong. Y'all ain't caught me on a fing thing wrong. Y'all wanna put me on that fing you, dude, dead ass. Hey. I've done nothing say. wrong. Hey. Just stay. Have I done anything no. wrong? Stay safe. Have I done anything hey. wrong? Hey. Hey. No! Yeah, I don't okay. know. No, what? I what I do? You just work. fought us no. in the parking lot. Well, you were under arrest. You just no, fought us I in the parking lot. I didn't fought you for shit. Yeah, I did not! Hey, I did not fought you for Hey, yeah, if just I fought you, I promise you, you know. What's your name? I promise you, you know. Just hey, no, us. if I fought you, you know. What's your name? My name's Colton. Colton? Yes, right, sir. My name's Officer Harper, all right? We take a couple deep breaths. Let's calm down a little bit, okay? All right? Is that good? <laughs> no! Okay. I so, didn't fight you. Okay. I just if fought I did, hey, okay. If I fought you, Colton, I when I... I swear you would know. When I got here. No, okay. I swear you would know. Okay, can you listen to him, please? Okay. When I got here, you were already on the ground in handcuffs. Okay? Yeah, that's fine. Now, before that, Absolutely. you started running. Okay? Uh, no, no, no. Now, at that point, that would be resisting. No, because I would okay? be fighting. At this point, the police officer had enough of their attitude and decided to continue with their inquiries and further procedures. Do you see her you in the how dumb okay. yeah. She's fine. Sit down. Please, okay. Kelsey, where is right. my husband? Okay. Kelsey, right give now, us Kelsey. a second. We're going to try to fix your handcuffs, right now, okay? Can we fix me, your handcuffs? Let me be with him. Let, let me talk yeah, to you. You're okay. right here. you can so, cuff me as... Right, yeah. Let me, said, okay? right. Please, let me be with him. Please, let me be with him. Let me talk to you real quick. Exactly. Hey, can I talk to you real quick, okay? All right, so he's right over there. I want to fix Please, your handcuffs real quick, okay? I want to fix your handcuffs real quick. Let's bring her out so we can fix the handcuffs. All right, let's, let's step on Excuse okay? me. This is my sergeant. That, like, just hey. like that guy that Kelsey, Kelsey, I'm not him. This is my I'm sergeant, him. Sergeant McCauley, okay? We're gonna fix He's my boss, okay? okay? We're gonna can fix him, okay? So I want you to step on out for me, okay? Can you unhook me and put me in the, in the middle? I'm not gonna, we, I'm we, not we gonna fight, I promise, not, I swear, I, we please. We know, we know you promise. I'm not gonna do it. I know, we just wanna help. I'm not gonna, gonna do it. Please okay? just put me in the front. We can't do that, okay? We're gonna fix him, We're gonna fix him, okay? I I was 11 years in healthcare. Please, I'm not gonna fight you. I know you're not gonna fight us, okay? How about we put you in, uh, in a better set of handcuffs? Can we do that for you? Yeah. Please put I've got, me I've got, with yeah, my husband. These are better, okay? Please put me with my husband. Just please relax. My, but, relax, Kelsey. Please, We're working put me on with it. my okay. husband. One step at a time. Okay? One step at a time. I'm not going to fight you guys. We know you're not going to fight us, okay? But we just want to put you in better. I'm not going to fight you We know that. We just want to put you in a nicer set of handcuffs. You know it's my okay. birthday. Okay. <laughs> well, how old are you turning, Kelsey? Yeah. Yeah, you know, if I if I wouldn't have been a part of this, you know, I would have been able to have fun. Okay. So <laughs> can what? I please, can I please see my husband? Not yet. Please, Not please, yet. can I please, Kelsey, can you please bring my husband? Please bring my husband. Kelsey, if you show him other things, if you show him where I'm Kelsey, at, he will not fight you. I, I promise. I need my husband. Things. Can you guys put him in the you front, please? We cannot do that, okay? The rules okay. say we can't, okay? Where, right. Where's my husband? Oh my god, double lock him, okay? Please, I need right. my husband. I right, need my husband. That, that yeah. mother is okay. a piece I'm, of I'm not worried about him. I'm not worried about him. Right. I need are, my husband. You and I are talking, okay? All right, right. sit back down. Your fell out of your pocket, Kelsey. Let's sit so back down. I, I, don't, I don't think you're going to do anything with... Put it back no, to your I need my husband. Sit back down, please. Okay? I, I want you to sit back down. I need my husband. I understand that, but I need you to sit back down so I can figure out what else is going on. 
Okay. Please. Thank you. All right. Please. Officer Harper, please. Can... listen, Kelsey. See, no, seriously, I can't. Kelsey, I, listen. I didn't do anything wrong, and Kelsey. you guys have my okay. arms. I did nothing Kelsey. wrong. Kelsey, stop. Okay. Let, let us figure out what's going on. Officer Harper, can stay right here. Please do not do anything to cause us any issues, okay? But I did, and not, I'll work I did nothing wrong, though. No. Well, I gotta figure out what's going on. I, okay? I need my. I gotta figure it out, okay? I need You're my... gonna stay right here with yep. Officer Harper, okay? No, you, you. Yeah, I'm gonna stay right here, okay? No, you. You do look like a Chad. What's right. your name, partner? What's your name, buddy? I'm Sergeant McCauley. I'm the boss out here. What's going on? You're the boss? Yeah, I'm the boss. What's going You're on? The, the, the NOBO out here? Yeah, what's going on? What's your name? So at least know what to call you. Leave her alone. Leave who alone? Kelsey. Kelsey, your wife? Okay. Yeah. She'd love to see you, but I need to talk to you. I need to figure out what's going on. What's going on? Why is she in handcuffs? Why are you in handcuffs? Why are you sitting on the ground? Like, what's going on? Because I'm so I'm out. That's why. I'm okay. That's fine. Okay, well, we, we don't arrest... Yes, and people being do. loud. Yes, you do. Okay, because those, are, crim those that's are criminal fair. offenses. That's, that's fine, that's fair. Okay. Yeah, those are pretty fine and fair. All right, Chad, the Brad's ain't going to okay. do all right? So what that's actually not. happened? What actually happened? She stays free, I'll, I'll let you go. What? You let, if I let her go free? Yep. Well, I don't know what happened. I don't, I don't even know what you guys are here for. I don't know why I'm here either. I don't either. I just don't. So I'm asking, Bradley's ass I'm asking you what, what's going on. Like, these fuckers are pretty tight, you know what I mean? Okay, well, let us check those for you. Okay, is, there, <laughs> is this your car? No. Is this Kelsey's car? Nope. Well, whose car is this? Yeah, uh, you know. No, I don't know. That's why I'm asking. I don't either. I mean, I just know I drive it every now and then. You know you drive it every now and then? Yeah, it's Perfect. A, it's so, a car. so I'm guessing the registered owner is giving you permission to drive it every now and then. It's registered in my Name. Is registered in your name? That. Okay, no. well, I don't know that. I haven't run the license plate, so oh, I have no shit. idea. Well, the, whoever's before you knows it's my name. Well, that's yeah, fine. I don't really name. care yes, what they know. I name. care yes, what sir. I know. Yes, sir. It's my name. Okay. And what's your name? Colton Boyd. What? Colton Boyd. Colton? Yes, sir. Hi, Colton. What happened out here, Colton? I just can't let her go to jail. Okay. Well, tell me what happened so I can see if she doesn't need to go to jail or not. She, I, I guarantee you. What? I guarantee you she didn't need to. Okay. My ass wife, yeah, I guarantee you, but if, if there's anything that even caused a f even somebody to look this way, it'd be my ass. So what happened though? That you ended up in handcuffs, she ended up in handcuffs, and now we're out here. What happened? Uh, that's not to be here or there. That's not to be here or there? Okay. Well, we're going to stand you up and at least check your handcuffs, okay? <laughs> Well, I don't like how these are set up, so we're going to fix these, okay? Do not tighten I'm not going to tighten No, 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 no. I don't like how they're set up, so we're going to fix them. Okay, but the big thing is here, no fighting or running or doing anything like that. Perfect. There's Officer Charles here, Charles Callie and myself. Relax, relax, relax. Bring your arm back. Bring your arm back. We can be really nice guys, but we can also be really mean guys. And I would just rather not be mean guys today. I don't know what Officer Callie's thinks, thinking He's is. Being oh, I don't think he was being an ass. I think maybe. Uh, all right, all right. I think someone maybe else. Smile. Like he knows. I think someone He's else. He's got pen up in there tucked in. He knows. Being an ass. Oh, oh, I don't think that. Really. You know what I mean? Okay. Relax. I'm right there by the book. Yeah, I get it. It's just. Well, a, I'm not right by the book. It's just a pen. I'm just a pen. You know what I'm saying? There we go. That's I'm better. just a little uh, goddamn pen on the flick. On the Where do you work at? VSI. VSI. Rivian. Rivian? Yeah. What do you do out there? Uh, I run a uh, forklift. Run a forklift? Yes, sir. How much do they pay you guys out there on a forklift? 22 an hour. 22 an hour? That's not bad. No, ain't it? That's not bad It's not at all. a bit dead ass. It's really not bad. Mm -hmm. No, I, I, like, that's really not bad. Oh, like, oh. Dez is pretty good. It could be, it could be worse. Yeah, it, right, right. I mean, de, no, no high school diploma, nothing. You can at least get a GED? I feel like, no. He's got to hold on to you. He's got to hold on to you because yeah, no, right, if, if you were to do something I silly and wrong. I have no GED. I got you. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't, I know. That's I, not bad, then. Like, no, but I'm not, like, you know, when you look at it on, put it on paper, mm. hell no. 
Would you want me around anybody that you know? F no. Hell no. You want me around your daughter, your f***ing mother, brother, sister, nothing. You want to me around them, right? And it's fine. Hey! Hey, hey, relax, relax. Relax. Officer Harper's talking Where's to her. Officer Don't Harper. let her scream. No, officer, she's screaming because she wants to see you. Okay, but I gotta have you both be calm. Okay? Officer Harper's just talking to her. That's it. We already fixed her handcuffs and everything to make sure she's more comfortable. Okay? We're treating her with all the respect that she deserves. Okay? But I ask you to listen to us and cooperate with us so we don't have to have anything go cry crazy sideways. Okay? Yeah. All right? Oh, it's him. All right. I like her. Lift your hands up for me. Thank you. I'm just going to pull these out, make sure there's nothing in the waistband. Is that her wallet there? Yeah. yeah. It's probably hers. I don't know which one you're talking about, but yeah. That gold one right there. Oh, yeah. I imagine hers. it's not yeah, yours. It's yeah. I mean, it okay. looked nice on me, right? Well, I mean, my match I mean, your eyes. it looked pretty sweet on me, you know right. what I'm saying? Oh, okay. Go. Just hang out here with Officer Cowley, okay? He, like I said, he's very nice if you're nice to him. Okay? Charles, hey, we're going to have Officer Cowley you put you in the car, okay? You hey, Colton, we're going to put you in the car, okay? Officer Charles is going to walk you to a car. Yeah. Uh, relax, 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 relax. Did I do what? What did I do? Relax. What did I do? Please don't pull. No, but what did I do? What's my charge? We want you to walk to the car. What did I do? Well, it sounds like you committed a battery and you resisted. How do I commit a battery? Listen, listen. How the f did I commit a battery? Listen to me. Oh, that's and also sounds. It also sounds like. Are you serious? That you're you're you've been driving under the influence of alcohol. Oh, I've never even driven. Why? Okay. So that we have issues. What did I do? Okay. No, please tell. You're shitting me. Oh, Chitter Bob done that. All right, let's have a seat in here. Please and thank you. Take a seat. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. Well played, Pussy. Please and thank you. Roll your next one. Roll your oh, leg. Hold no, no. How do I how do I get this charge? Roll your leg in. No, no, no I will. Well, thank you. How do, how do I get this charge? Oh, I just want, we're gonna keep moving and keep progressing no, I'm, through. I'm it. literally okay. not either. I don't put your leg in all the way. Put your foot in all the way. My foot's all the way. Thank you. We're just gonna seat belt you in for safety, okay? After a while, police conducted a search of the couple's vehicle as it was part of their normal procedures. Soon they would find the reason behind their peculiar behavior. Just for 43, there's a half empty bottle of Tito's. And a smaller empty bottle. We got a bag of cocaine in the car. It was sitting next to her. Should never leave your cocaine where the police can find it. Colton Boyd was charged with aggravated DUI, possession of controlled substance, and resisting. Colton was found guilty of aggravated DUI, while the other two charges were eventually dismissed. He was sentenced to a 30-month probation and 170 days in jail. Kelsey Rich was charged with aggravated battery, possession of a controlled substance, and resisting. She was eventually found guilty of possession of a controlled substance and sentenced to a 24 month probation and 30 hours of community service. While Colton and Kelsey learned a valuable lesson that never escalate the situation, our next individual decided that she would escalate it not once, but twice. But before that, let's see what happens when someone decides to be as obnoxious as possible to a cop. You are under arrest, do not resist. Why? The incident revolved around a man named Candy Boltsky. On the 20th of June, 2023 in Key West, Florida, police responded to the scene after this man had an argument with a convenience store cashier over a vape pen refund. Soon, the police came to the spot and located the individual. Extracting the truth out of a suspect is a tough task on its own. It becomes even more daunting when a language barrier exists. The whole investigation becomes a foggy English morning where cops have to navigate an arduous path to reach the truth. Okay. He's not working. He don't want to change. Okay. He don't, uh, no receipt. 
never give me receipt. Okay. Uh, because uh, come back and that's it. I told please return me this shit. Okay. Possible. So what else happened? Uh, what happens? I, uh, he don't wanna re uh, return. I told lie, 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 you stupid shit. Return. Okay. He don't wanna. I will call to police. Call to police. Okay. Did you break his cash register? Uh, Did you break the cash register? No, of course. Are you sure? Sure, people stay, of course, sure. Or you want to check my wallet? Ah, yeah, I, don't okay. put your hands no in your pockets, problems. okay? So, I don't know what happened right now. So, right now, you're being detained. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Drop your lighter. Drop your lighter. Hey, come on! Why you do this again? Okay, 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 okay. Okay, again you move me inside. Guys, incorrect. Do not resist. You are under arrest. Do not resist. Why? What happens? Uh, what I am doing wrong? Put your hand behind your back. Or you're gonna get hurt. Put your hand behind your back. All right, nine, ten, fifteen. Everybody can slow. Again. Okay. Yep. Can you hold on to this? Whatever you need, buddy. You let me know what you need. I'm just gonna tighten these up there. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna switch that one around. Yep. Do not move. I think it's this one needs to be switched. Yeah. That's the one you're going. Go over to the store. He's gonna take that cuff off and we're gonna reposition your arm. When he takes it off, if you pull away, it's gonna work out really horribly, okay? I wanna speak with somebody who can uh, support me. Guys. Well, what do you do? There we go. All right. I think we're good. Nope. Do anything in your pockets? Okay. He's got his two little vape pen things here. Yeah, take those, bud. Yeah, test them for THC. Yeah, really ask him. Why he lost? Provide no good. This Indian man. What happens with him? Doing something really stupid. Into something really stupid. No, maybe I'm really stupid. What are you doing? You're going to jail now. Again? For what? I see a R I For what? I will go to jail. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. What? Take down. Yeah. Okay. Please, guys, don't use this. So? Again, I will go from. Ah. Okay, let's see.
<laughs> step by step, okay? You got evidence, guys? Why? Why? Because I am asking. Are you telling me my money? I told you why. And then you decided why? you didn't want to. Why? You because didn't I am asking. Are you telling me my money? Let's see. Oh, 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 okay. So you know there's camera recording stuff, car. Yes. What are the chances that lightning will strike twice at the same place? It appears that the impossible has happened, as the cops realize that getting a statement from the victim will also be filled with hurdles to some extent. So my name is Officer Andrade, hey, by the way. We have him in custody. Yeah, he already left. No, we have him in custody. Really? Yeah, so he's down on the corner right there on uh, Flagler and Bertha with okay. other officers, and they have him in custody. Why don't you tell me what happened? The, he bought this pen. Okay, he bought oh, that. Okay. Yeah, maybe two hours or something else uh, or before. Okay. I came here 10 o'clock. Not my time. He come here, this not to work, you have to change it. He drunk. Mm -hmm. His uh, attitude, everything is rough. Okay. I, uh, this not to work. You have to change it. Um, you have receipt? No. I have no receipt. Then I don't sell to you. You talk the same guy mm -hmm. who sell to you. He will change it. Don't you? Okay. You have to do it. He's angry. He's angry. You have to do it. I buy from here. I mean, okay, fine. You buy from here. If not work, we change it. Mm -hmm. But you have no receipt. I don't know where you buy from. Right. You can buy the other store too. Sure. Also. Yeah, they sell those everywhere. So I can do it. If talk the same guy, he will change it. Mm -hmm. No, you have to do it. I buy from here. He's crazy. Then he's talk so loud. Your officer, I call him. He already listened mm -hmm. what he tell. Okay. He, I am not leaving from here. The customer on the line. Uh -huh. He don't leave the phone. Okay. The, the, then I call. And so, and then what happens? So he's here, he's saying like, hey, I'm not yeah. leaving, you're on the phone yeah, with the police. Yeah, yeah. yeah and then call what the happens? police, call the police, I'm not leaving. No customer can come in my register. Okay. Then I call the police, uh, 9 on, and then he left. And then he left, did he break anything, take no. anything? No. Okay, so basically he was impeding you conduct your normal business because of his yeah, disorderly yeah, conduct. Yeah, yeah. Would you like to press charges uh, so for the disorderly conduct? That's a trespassing. He, Did you uh, ask him to leave? Yeah, I, I tell him you have to leave. And he, he didn't he, leave? No, he didn't leave. Okay, so... He always like that. He always drunk 24 hours. Mm -hmm. He come all day long, all night long. Mm -hmm. He's uh, like this. So... Okay. I, I, I don't know uh, him. He uh, can come here. Okay, you want him trespass for the future. Yeah, future. But I'm saying for, for causing the disruption, no, do you no, want to press okay, charges? Yes, okay, no, sir. You don't want to press I, charges? I, 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 uh, you sure? Yes, yes sir. Okay, what about That's for... Uh, trespassing. Uh, he, he, what about for... Do you want him press charges for trespassing? When you tell somebody leave and they don't leave, then they're trespassing. Yeah. So do you want to press charges for that? No. So you're saying you don't want to press charges no, for anything? No, no. Just you just don't want him ever to come yeah, back? Ever to come back. Okay. Yeah. Can I have your ID, please? Yeah. I got gotcha. you. Do you want to go... Um, yeah, I'll talk to you outside. Excuse me for one second. I'll yeah. open it in this part. The officers are trained from the beginning to do their due diligence before concluding any investigation. This may include any queries that the suspect has. The aim of this is to make sure no one can exploit any loophole in the legal system. I didn't find an ID on you at all. Do you have one with I you? I have at home. I at home. immediately closed the okay. streets. Okay. What's your last name, sir? Andy Bogotsky. Can you spell that for me? K-A-N-G-I. Mm -hmm. B-O-L. Can you yep. right? Yep. N G B 
Yep. Yeah, that's right. I'm K A N D I Kanzibalutsky. I'm asking if the next letter is a B, as in boy. Okay, B. Yes. O okay. L T S K Y Y. Y Y. Yes. Okay. What's your first name? Constantine. Constantine. Yes. Spell that for me so I get it right. Uh, Ukrainian, Russian, English. How you? Spell it for me. Uh, C O N. <laughs> uh, okay. uh, Constantine. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. C I, I know you were uh, Constantine. T I N E. Have you ever been arrested here before? Never, guys. I just oh. come and ask him why he Do you have it. Do you have a middle name at all? No. Okay. Then what's your date of birth, sir? Do you have a Florida ID? Yes, in my house. Okay. Of course. So you understand, do you understand why you're going to jail right now? No. Okay. So when I told you that I'm going to detain you in handcuffs, I will go and to I jail. Listen. I listen. And then I went to put the handcuffs on and you pulled your hands away from me and then you were grabbing at my arm. Can't do that. Okay. Okay. I am not touch you. You're Okay. I am you're, not touch you. That's you're, it. You're lucky. You know this. You're lucky I didn't knee you in the face. I did that as a favor. Uh, guys, uh, Oh, you jumping, I touch a policeman. You okay? It's okay? No. Or just around. Uh, you can't rest? do that. In the US. You cannot do that. Of what I am doing? I just come to this store. Ask. Yep. And now I so, kill. Uh, what I am doing with you? Kill you or touch you? No. Just touch. You tried I to get away. Touch you. you tried to get away. Anyway, so you can't come back to the store. Ever. If you come back to the store, you will be arrested anywhere on the property. Okay? If you come back on this property, you will go to jail. Do you understand? Okay. Okay. Sounds good. All right. Let's see if I can find him. Recording again, okay? Stay here. Stay here. Stay here. You? Not right. That'll be up to the jail staff. They will answer that question for you. Okay. Hey, stop going to jail. I'm not going to pay uh, nothing. Guys, don't tell me what happens. Okay? I'm so sorry. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Kandabolsky was charged with resisting and transported to Monroe County Detention Center. As mentioned before, now we will see someone hitting the jackpot twice and receiving the grand prize of felony charges. You are under arrest! Ow! Come out! The incident revolved around a woman named Asia Delane. On the 20th of November 2022, in Alaco, police responded when they came to know the misconduct of an irate neighbor. She erupted in anger towards a couple with a child. The couple tried to walk away, but Asia escalated the situation. Police promptly reached the location. Children are the radiant angels of our world, deserving of tender care and graceful conduct in their presence. Yet what happens when shocking events unfold before their innocent eyes? It's abnormal when someone acts belligerently in front of a child, 
However, it becomes infuriating when that behavior escalates to brutality, especially towards a married couple with a child. Uh, Delaney. Her uh, name uh, is uh, Deja uh, Delaney. Yeah, Asia, Asia Deja Delaney. Deja Delaney. How do you know her? She's next door neighbor. Yeah, she stayed. Do right you here. guys live here? No, 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 no. We, we, we ran here to issues. my daughter's house, and I yeah. came to get my daughter, and I was fit to get ready to ride back to Newbury. Okay. And who, lives, who lives here? I, oh, we we just told, left oh, around yeah, there because she wouldn't let us stop, baby. and okay. we wanted yeah. to pull in. She, he had to drive away with the door flapping open. She kept pulling. She yeah. kept Look at the opening hood. the door. Hi, baby. She sounded loud at the car, man. Right? Are you? What's your name? The car that I witnessed that like hit the car. She, she had uh, like hit me in the back of the head, but I was running away. And and, and throw throw shit at the bottle and all. Got me up. Yeah. Okay. I tried. I was filming some of it. Until it got physical, like until it got just started um, going crazy. Are you injured at all? No, I mean I'm, you know. How do you, how I'm, do you know her? I'm his wife, and she's the daughter uh, of the next door neighbor. You guys are gonna have to break it down for me she, because I don't know you guys. Okay, so. she, she's the oh. daughter, the, the like twenty early twenties daughter of the next door neighbor. Okay. So and they live right. So you up only here. know her because you you live because, next to her. Yeah, they like he. You know, he knows all everybody works longer than I do, so mm -hmm. I don't really know. But I know her via that. So you can hear she's like, I don't care. All right, all right. Why is she so mad? She... She's upset because she liked me. Okay. And she was when when me and my when she sucked my wife pictures of, of of us, she tried to say I was always with her, and then she okay. tried to say I was at her house this morning. What was I? With my wife at the f house. Okay. So, I'm, I, it's scary. I'm sorry. So when I come up to the house just now, I come up to the house to get my daughter, and I was gonna ride back to Newbury. She come running downstairs at first, and I heard some say boom. So I stopped the car because I was pulling out. So when I stopped the car, I got out. She threw a, a bottle, like a a a, 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 a marinade bottle or something. Then she came downstairs and sprayed my car down like that. Then she forced her way in the car, trying to get in the car. And I'm trying to pull off my door. She's done this car several times. I think that she kept opening this door to get in, and her mom was trying to. Can you just see how the dirt she jumped in? He gave this car a match. She hit me in the back of the head, but I was like running away. Like, that's a good bottle. Where? Yeah, where did the bottle hit? One hit the back. I was on that side, so I didn't see it, but she was on, she was on that side, on the apartments, and I was on this side towards the road, and it, I heard that, oh, and then I saw that, when she, she, uh, squirted garbage and saw the shit going all that shit, that's some of the sauce, that's some of the sauce from the other, first one, she threw it and it hit my car, but it was a plastic thing, I thought it was a bottle, so when I looked at it, it was right by the tree in the yard, where I was backed up at, because my wife truck was, pulled in and I backed up right Open next to her and got my baby to put it in the car. She was up on the porch, never said yeah. to it. And I went in the house and as soon as I get in the car, lock the doors to get ready to pull off, I heard the boom, so I stopped. And when I got out, she come running downstairs, spraying all this on me, forced her way, getting in the car. I got her mugshot. Crushed that, that my lady that in all. Right? And I said, you going to jail. Ain't nobody got time for this foolish. This girl right here. She came around, she was, her mom was like, come on baby, don't do that. And I was like, get the f away from my baby, I was there. And then she was uh, like, uh, oh, you better run me. Came, just came running around and Ronnie was like, don't do it, don't do it. And I, by the time I realized like she was still coming, I started like going like this and I was going like that. And she was yeah, popping I, I, back I, I, of the head. I, 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 but then he literally rushed in. up to my lady like she was going to hit her. Yeah. And I said, you ain't going to with my lady, man. And then I grabbed her and said, get in the car, let's go. Yeah. Every time but I tried to get after, in the car, she, she kept pulling the damn door trying that to was go. After she then she me. came around now. And when, when she opened this door, I got out the car to run around and shut the door to get out of my car. You know what I'm saying? saying? So when, when she got out the car, her mama was pulling her too. She mm -hmm. shut my door. I kept trying to hit the lock button over him, but it won't lock. So I have to go over there because I got the one door that unlocks and unlocks the door. So I tried to go to the driver's door to do it. Then she jumped back in. Then she pulled this door trying to reach in over him. And then I say, man, my baby right there, you going to jail. That's that's like, you forcing your way in my shit. You going to jail, bro. Straight up. Yeah, she's being reckless. So I told her, I say, and her mama kept saying, leave that boy alone, leave that boy alone. And then 
people I knew it. I'm sure. I, I was pulling it. out of the yard, and the neighbors, all the neighbors, was out. They heard it. So uh, as I'm pulling out the yard, license? then that's when she yeah. saw me in my lady car, and she stopped, and she got out. So I had to stop to go back to make sure they don't fight. Any normal sane person would want to clear their name of any accusations. So it is completely natural that acting in the opposite way will raise eyebrows. Any logical law enforcement officer can interpret it as an admission of guilt. So did our prime suspect decide that she should present herself as a normal person to clear her name? Or did she pull something that would leave everyone flabbergasted? Let's find out. What the hell is going on? They just pull back up. You can ask my auntie, my auntie's in there. I literally, then I just tell you that she was out of something. She just literally told this man that I bust his window and I didn't even touch his window. She's trying to get me to go to jail. I just told you that. Okay. It was reported that we tried to pull up. All right, okay, find you back. They're Touch lying. Your hands okay, your back. okay, whatever, whatever, whatever. I did not. Can you stop touching me, Mama? Tell her to come out now. Okay, I'm, I tell her to come out, but put it down, please. No, tell her to come out. May, come out. Her grandson is in there. She can't go nowhere. Let me I don't care. May, come out. Her grandson is here. She's here. Come out. Come on, come on, baby. Come on. Come on, May. Oh, oh, because I told you. Come out now. You are under arrest. Come out. I got one fighting, one at Taser Point. I'm not fighting nobody. You're dead lying. Get out. Come on out my house, man. Get out, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Because I don't want y'all tearing my house up. I don't want my house to up. May, come out. Please come out. Come out, May. Come out. Get, get out of the house. My Anyone friend. else in here? My friend. Get out of the house. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Put my phone. Just get out. Just get out. Hey, you need to come outside now. Come on, Don't come in here. Don't come in here. Don't come in here. Hey, you need to come outside now. Make this a lot easier. You need to be watching it. Ain't no telling what they'll do to your house. Hey, can you guys, like, if she comes out, the other she starts shooting you in the chair. She not. 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 I don't see reason why she can't fight to talk to this man. Okay. She haven't did anything. Go outside. Why well, I gotta leave my Go outside. Asia, we're not going anywhere. Come out. She don't got no gun. Ain't no weapons in here. Okay. I'll go open the door myself. Is the door locked? No. That's why I say I'll go open the door myself. Asia, you need to come out so we make this easier. I don't want to do this all night. Go, go. She can come in there and open the door. Hey, if you're in this room, put your hands up now. You're gonna get dog bit. Put your hands up now. Are you was for the sake of the jail? Yeah. For what? For felony charges. I'll set myself back. Close myself where, back. Where would she go? I wouldn't know. You don't know. Hey, if you're inside, come out now. Is there, is there any of that insulation on the Well, there is now. <laughs> I don't think she's up there. Did she just talk to you? Yes, she did. It said what? It doesn't matter. She's going to jail. Uh, I mean, I can't help you. I mean, I can't stop the law. She didn't come back to talk to me. She never left. She didn't leave. 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 She did. I swear to God, on my, 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 on my, on my, on my, she did leave. She up in the red truck, and then she came back. How old is your daughter, ma'am? That's a long drop to make from there. But, I mean, if she's and he, committed... he was in this threshold here, not one of them. Huh? Correct. He fought with her here, apparently. No, he, she was trying to shut the door. 
kick the door. They want to fight. He's trying to drop the back. Oh, she, she comes back, right? She going otherwise she's gonna so have a warrant for arrest. That's her. Y'all ain't gonna get all that. No, ma'am. Mm -mm. Not when we're looking for a subject with wanted for battery on a law enforcement officer, which is a felony. She didn't do that. She didn't hit him. Well, yes, she did. What she did? She did hit him. Okay. And she also tried to slam a door on a, on his hand. So that is a, that is a felony crime. Okay. And I will tell you this: if she does not turn herself in. She, she's she's gonna have a warrant for her arrest. It's gonna be listen to me. It's gonna be turned over to the U.S. Marshals Task Force. Okay. Many people are under the false assumption that police do not do their due diligence before apprehending someone. It is simply not true. They always hear both sides' accounts before deciding how to proceed. Just like it happened in Asia's case. So what I need you to do is I need you to uh, go find them. But can I explain the story? Sure. Okay, so this is what happened. I was knew that my cousin had been trying to party. Mm -hmm. Um because of my cousin just moved around from here, from Instagram. She was having a house in my party. Ronnie called, but I didn't see it until I got home because my phone was dead. He had called me and was like he was coming in the house to come my home. So when I got home, I had seen him, he was with another female that, that morning mm -hmm. or whatever. I was like, okay, you want to play these games? I'm not and y'all been together games. all year? We've been together for, I've been talking to him since I was 14 years old, but we okay. got together, you know, we went to prison, he just not getting now. Okay. So I just started back talking to him. So I, um, I got home or whatever, I um, went to sleep. When I woke up the next morning, I seen that he called me. He said that he had to go to Tampa and I want to ride with him. But I didn't see the messages until like, it was like one something because that's what time I woke up. Mm -hmm. So when I wrote back, he was like, it was too late. But he told mm -hmm. me to go to my mom's house because you know, he stayed next to my mom. Then meet mm -hmm. him at my mom's house because he was going to bring me the money because I was supposed to get an abortion because you know, I was pregnant. Okay. I didn't want so to you're pregnant. currently pregnant? I'm currently pregnant okay. now. She knows that and he knows that. So he was going to Tampa. I don't know why he was going there, but he told me on the way back, he was going to give me the money. That's why I was supposed to go to my mom's house. So when I got to my mom's house, he wasn't there. Mm -hmm. She was there at his house. Well, that's not even his house. That's not their house. That's somebody else's house. So I was sitting on the porch. I came, I sat down, I said, I'm fresh. I said, Mom, I'm out here. So I left out the house. I went over to the neighbor's house. Remember, I told you I was mm -hmm. her son. I went and got Nana. We was in the house. We were chilling for a little bit. I'm texting him. He called me. He told me that just hang out because I told him I was hungry. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go because, you know, I don't stay here. I'm just mm -hmm. coming to visit or whatever. And I only come here if he's here. Because I have a house in Majestic, but I don't be in Majestic. Okay. So, then yeah, after that... Like, you, you, you leased the apartment there? I stayed there. I've been staying oh, there okay. since I was 16 years old. Okay. Now I got a master code. So, after that, he told me, he was texting me, he was he was telling me to um, just stay in the house, don't come out. I didn't understand why he was telling me, because, you know, I'm young, you know, mm -hmm. I'm talking. He was just telling me to stay in the house, don't come out, or whatever. So, you know, I kept looking out the window every five minutes to see where he was at because it was getting late, it was getting cold, it was getting dark. So he was like, um, he called, he was like, um, he coming, it was a traffic jam, he was on the way to Tampa. Mm -hmm. So he pulled up, and when he pulled up, he backed in. He didn't come upstairs at all. So he was sitting out there, he was smoking his cigarette. The wife finally heard him come out there, um, heard him outside. She came outside, I was sitting on the porch. And she told him, she was like, come upstairs. She was like, I'm gonna come upstairs in a minute after I get done smoking my cigarette. Mm -hmm. So she went back in and then she came up and go, she had a baby on her head. So I'm in, I'm still sitting on there, I'm on the phone, on Snapchat, I'm on the phone with somebody. She was like, come upstairs, what's taking you so long to come upstairs? And then that's when she pointed at me, she was like, oh, you must be waiting on this thing right here. That's why I need to come upstairs. So he was like, just go in the house. And then she went in the house and he was like, go get the bag. So when she went in the house, he told me to hurry up and come downstairs to grab the money from him because he had the money in the hand. So I walked downstairs, me and him was downstairs. Her and the baby came downstairs. She had the baby on her mm -hmm. She put the baby in the car. He told me to get in the car because there was two cars. It was a white Audi and it was a blue. She had a blue truck. He told me to get in the car because he was going to take me home because she was doing too much. So what she did, she ran back upstairs. She grabbed some barbecue sauce. The um, I don't know what kind. It was some barbecue sauce. She came back upstairs and she was like, you need to get out of the car. This is my car. This is my husband. You're harassing us. I said, I'm not harassing you. How am I harassing you? He told me to get in the car. Mm -hmm. So I got out of the car because they were just doing too much because she got on the, on the passenger because, you know, I'm on the passenger side. Mm -hmm. She got on the driver's side and she started to pull the um the ignition. She tried to put it in reverse while I was sitting in the car. Okay. So I hopped out of the car. So I ran around the car. She followed me. I said, if you hit me, you're going to go to jail because I'm pregnant. Mm -hmm. So after that, after um she said that, she reached over. I said, um, she told me, you need to leave. You harassing us. I'm going to call the police. I said, well, call the police because I don't care. I'm not doing anything to you. My understanding from what happened yesterday, there was a pretty decent fight that took place. 
but it was between her and the deputy. Really? Information they had, they tried to interview on it. She went to go run away. She grabbed her, tried to arrest her, and they go to the ground. She takes one foot, she kicks a door, hits him with the door. <laughs> now he's at home, he might have a broken hand. So she has other charges that are, are pending on that. So I'm just letting you know that when she's finished with this, because we were told to come here and get a statement that she wanted to write a statement. We want to get her side for everything. We understand that, but we're we're going to take her tonight. Okay, I don't want to. I don't need any. That and battery on law enforcement. Yeah. And before that, when she ran into the house trying to run away, because the door, I think someone had opened the door they were at and she went through the door and then when he grabbed her they were on the ground he's holding her by her uh, either her ankle or her calf she kicks the door into his hand that lets him to let go because now uh, i don't know if it's fractured or not but they he can't come to work anymore right. <clears throat> and then she ran to the back of the house and then we got people around the house the back window was open and she took off wow. through the back of the house so after she after home she got out she pulled the phone out then she set the phone down. Then she chased me around the car after I spilled on her money because she started chasing me. Mm -hmm. And I said, you're mad? What are you mad for? And she's like, you're harassing us. You're on, you're on our property. I said, I'm not on your property. I said, my mom's here. I said, he told me to come here. So after that, I said, this is our baby daddy. She reached up and she spit on me. Mm -hmm. So what I did was, my mom said, don't do nothing. Go back upstairs. She told me to go back upstairs. I'm going to handle it. So what I did was, I went back upstairs. I got my stuff and I left. I went around the corner and I left. What's her name? <laughs> I, mean, I don't know her name. Okay. I just know it started with an L. But that's the wife. That's the wife. I didn't even know he had a wife. So I came out. I stepped by the door. And as I stepped behind the door, he told me to put my phone down. So I put the phone down. I think he was on top of me. So I did like this. He told me to put my hand on my back. I'm thinking he was going to put my hand on my back. He grabbed my hand like this. He asked my mom. And he yanked me like this. Mm -hmm. And the door was halfway open. So I fell. And then that thing, you know, he did like this with a taser. He was like, come here. Come here. Come here. And that's what he was going to do. Like, like, I was like, no, I'm scared, I'm scared. And then, my, you know, my baby, he's up in front of me because he's shooting tasers. I said, please don't taser my son. Here. So I closed the door, and my son opened the door back up, and he ran back out there with my mom. So then he was still holding the taser like this, and I seen the light. And next thing you know, I seen the light. I opened the window, and I jumped down. And then I ran around, and then I. Is that what your. What's your. That, your this hand? is from when he smashed my hand in the door. The officer. Okay. I can show you it from when he smashed it. I won't take it down there. No, you don't need to. Well, I got, I took videos and pictures of everything. Okay. Um, so during that, um, the, the deputy was injured, okay? Uh, I believe his hand's broken from it. But I didn't do that. That's, that's what I'm trying to tell you. I wasn't in the door. I didn't smash his hand in the door. Lauren and them was still out there. Okay. I had left. I didn't okay. touch him. Okay. Um, well, as of tonight, you're going to have to go to jail, okay? Can you please that's put your... That's what I asked you before can you, you came. Please put your hands behind your back. <laughs> Just relax. Ooh, help, hair, help me. Her hair. Oh, you see, that's why they want to meet always. You always go to jail and now you want to fall. I guess it might be double locked or something. <laughs> Oh my God, just relax. Oh my God. I'm gonna lose my job. I gotta go. I gotta wait all the way to Naples. No. No. Oh my God. 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 I didn't really hold that. Yeah, yeah hold it. Just hold it down. Please call my mama. Please, please, please call my mom. This is not fair. He lied to me. That's why I did not want to be that way. Because he lied to me. You lied to me. No, I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Please, I don't want to go. Please, calm down. Please, please. We're going to ask you to walk. Please, 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 please
After apprehending Asia, the officers went through their usual procedures, including making sure their suspect was not in immediate danger. However, what she had in store for them would prove that she herself was the danger. I understand it's a tough time right now. Okay. Let's just, let's just... I can do that for nobody, I promise. All right, do not resist. I'm not resist. I don't want to resist. I'm okay, not right, resist. Right, I'm just honey. frustrated. Okay, okay. I understand the frustration. Just take a deep breath. Take a nice deep breath in. Count to four. Oh. Hold it for four. All right. Relax. I'm not... You put your two hands. Turn your wrist and switch her. Oh, finger. Oh. Okay, watch her finger. No, she got a hurt finger. finger. Okay, we okay. see it. We see, see it. it. Just you just pushed it. It's already okay. taken off. Okay. okay, just get your hands closer. I need to right. push that a little bit. Can you please get this one again? Right yeah, here. I'll get a band aid for you, okay? You get it. Please don't make me go to this place. Please. He's going please. to jail. Please. 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 I didn't do anything. Please. I don't want to go to this place. Please. I promise you, I didn't do it. I promise you this time. Okay. I promise you this time. It wasn't it's me. Not, it's not up to us at this point. I know okay. it's it. I know, but it wasn't my fault. Please, please. sir. Please. please. I promise you, please. it wasn't my fault. Please I know I didn't. Okay. Please. Please step oh in. Oh my God. Watch your head. No, don't let me go in. Please. I don't want to go. Asia Delane was charged with battery on an officer, resisting arrest with violence, and burglary with battery, among other charges. For videos about criminals, hit the subscribe button.